Bonsoir. Good morning. Good afternoon. Good evening. I'm just gonna turn the music down just a titch. Uh, let me just let people know on Instagram that we're live. And hello, Frankie. Though. Hello, everyone in chat that's lurking, watching the VOD, or hanging out. If you're watching this on YouTube, uh, hello, especially to you, cause what up? Uh, cause uh, all the VODs are there, and like, if you are catching up on Throne Hub Sands, I'm not gonna say this is the halfway point, cause I don't think this is. This is meant to be a four-year campaign, and we're in year two, and like, we haven't even got past like year one's plan. Uh, but that's purely on me being uh, bad at planning things. But hello, everyone. How you doing? How is everyone's week? weekend going how 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 old are things frankie also i hope you enjoyed that vip badge i've just given you Sorry, typing and like texting at the same time. I mean, talking and like typing a story on uh, Instagram is is tricky. Hello, everyone. What up? I will do a not exactly a recap, but like explaining what this uh, session is in a hot second because it's a it's a special session of tests. Um, this is a uh, special little dream session when uh, we when we're a bit short on players or one player down i'm planning on doing a little maybe a little dream session maybe is uh is something i'm thinking of and and so uh and today's session we're gonna focus on our boy uh on Randall. Don't worry about it. It's fine. I forgot uh, Flowers Instagram, so I'm just gonna quickly look for that, and then uh, I will. I will do. Sorry, this is, this is very like. Me being slow on the intro, I know I'm normally a bit more, I come in a bit more prepared, but I wanted to make a story for this. It, what's the word? It backfired. Yeah, today's uh, I've, I'm pretty I'm pretty excited. I think it's gonna be a little funky session. If you are new here and didn't already know, we do chat point interactions with channel points, and with those interactions, you can help or hinder the party. And every single one of them is designed to be used. It's not um. It's not intrusive or anything, so if you want to use them and want to take part in the session, they are there for you to use and uh, and affect our affect our session in in the in these these funky little scenarios or little events that uh, that you can influence that can obviously help or hinder the party depending on either if they're their actions or character related. Twitch. Shooting stars in your eyes, you're bringing me to life. Love how you see. 
gitu ya So yeah, I shall guess out in session in a second, but like to those um, that are not watching live, but like watching right now, um, or watching, well, basically watching it in the order that it's uh, uh, being streamed. Cause like, I'm not sure where I'm going to put it in the session, uh, in the playlist order, mainly cause this is a dream sequence that happens in the middle of a session. Uh, so that's why it's 36.5 during when the party return to, to rest next session this will happen during uh randall's sleep next session essentially and that's that's how it's uh how we're gonna that's how how it's framed in the in the order so it might play either after the session or before but we'll see but um streamed wise it'll be before the session obviously so uh i'll be right back in a half second i can play the intro and i uh, hope you enjoy Bonsoir. Hello, everyone. Welcome to uh, session 36.5 of Throwing Us Up Sands. Why is he, I should hide Yuki? He's not, he doesn't exist right now. I'm going to hide this. Oh, that's the wrong one. I'm going to hide that. There we are. Hello, everyone, and uh, welcome. Yeah, welcome to this uh, today's, to today's session. I am just remembered why I had that there. So I'm going to quickly just change something on uh, this because I'm not prepared, clearly. Where is... Why was he says he's prepared. And then I know, on. I know. Every time, every time, I said I was ready for the <laughs> session. It's like, oh, I'm ready. You guys want to start baby a bit early? <laughs> All right, listen here. And here we are. Oh, I guess that, <laughs> I guess they don't have a headshot. Interesting. I thought I did do a headshot for them. Ah, to be fair, they don't really do much in the headshot. Oh, it scared me. M -m Multi kill. Yeah, I'm telling you, Jack. <laughs> <laughs> What's the one that makes you crack up? I can't remember. What was it? Monster kill. I can't remember which one it is. I don't. I, I, don't, I think you need monster. Or is house. it just like the holy shit? Like that one. I think it's, it's monster house time. That's what gets me. M -m monster house. I can't remember Sam. But I don't know. If this is a reference to in in all fairness. I assume, assume it's Halo. That but... was from Halo. Yeah, no, but like I don't like those. No, or something like that. It was. I think it was Quake or something like that. I think it was Quake, yeah. Like, I, doubt, I doubt in Halo they were like, holy shit. Yeah. Like, that'd be hilarious. I think that was, like, later on. But, like, um, <laughs> let's let's get into the session. Because uh, because we're digressing. As I'm going to change the song. Because this is not uh, not the music right now. Let's play Sorry if some the fireworks are coming through on my mic. Yeah, oh yeah. It's Bonfire oh, yeah, Night. Oh yeah, y'all are... 
So apologies. I just yeah, I just remembered. <laughs> Thanks for reminding me. Jim. Remember, remember, gang. The fifth of November. E. I just learned that that wasn't about V for Vendetta. Uh, yeah, I text me to Sam, <laughs> and I might be yeah, wrong. Like he... I mean, you it's might be in wrong. V for Vendetta. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah, It's like yeah, yeah, like, it's, it's, like, yeah. Part, it's like the like the part of V for that's like important. Yeah. I was saying how like it feels like it's it's like a turn on it because it's making it almost a good thing. Alright, it's not playing it's the playlist. A, yeah, it's about um, an attempt to blow up Parliament. So this is I not playing... I don't want to say anything. <laughs> <laughs> the music's not played the way I thought it was going to play, so I've got to do this. The theory that should work? Question mark? Excellent. Perfect. Alright. <clears throat> Randall? You're... You awake a border ship. Your ship. A fine vessel that would sail with a, and you'd command a ragtag skeleton crew. What was that ship called, might I ask, before we go further? Uh, the Crystal Voyage. The Crystal Voyage. Aboard the Crystal Voyage, you see your crew. Hikari Satuya, a blue tiefling in a ragged old harry from her homeland, Shireleo. Her mane shaggy and wild like the wind of Tahashimare. Or, or so she says, at least. She's looking forward to returning to home, even if it's only to just to drop off a few diamonds and magic crates uh, that you guys have smuggled. Alongside Hika uh, Hikari? Jason Anders, a Leonin in a billowing tunic and nightly plate on his lower half. His blonde mane and tan fur, a common look of his homeland of Veneer. But the youngster wanted to find a different life, where he wouldn't be the same as everyone else. So you took him on. Bonezog, a goblin covered in a large red lobster scale uh, uh, suit of armor from the legendary Robu. Uh, from Nilbog's hub, this goblin left in search of the old mayor, but found Randall and joined him in his hope to bring plumbing to his land, where the old mayor promised, had, or promises had become a distant dream. Richard Bamberton III. From Halagis, just like you, uh, Randall. Covered, into he covered head to toe in tattoos of every monster the crew had fought. You you have come a long way as, as a group with uh, with Richard. Oh, sorry, I forgot to mention, they're a uh, harring gun. Uh, a, hair, a hair folk, as when you both joined uh, Diamonds and Magic. Flavia Antonia, wearing a bedazzled eye patch. The Aracocra, Aracocra swings across the riggings. She is she keeps an eye out for the shores of Shreleo. Her rainbow feathers dancing in the wind. Her shawls trailing after her. And finally, Mlud. A fish of a man. They were flopping around the deck as they're providing the meal of the day. Some pie of, of sorts. Randall? As like you're just like watching your crew. Is there anything? How do you feel? Because like you, you, you feel like you're back in time almost. The music's a bit starry, so I'm just gonna do this. Yeah, um, uh, I feel play. My, I mean, my heart is swelling because of the uh, emotions just of seeing all these people again. Do I feel as though this is real or um, or do I think my the, the past with Lonico and, and everyone else was a dream? Like, do you want to roll for me? Um, what's it called? A insight? Yeah, roll for me insight with disadvantage. Perfect, yeah. Oh, shoot. 15. 
Let me just do that again. Uh, that's right. 13. Oh, sorry, 13. Sorry. I saw the five and like that. So, little... oh shit. Oh, and then an edge. Yeah. No, that's a shame. Like, yeah. 13, yeah. No, it's all good. Yeah. No, it's. There's a hint of you that feels that this is that, that you 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 can remember some girl with a mask of a fox and a man made of stone and another made of water. But that feels like a lifetime ago, or a lifetime to must have. have been a, must have been a strange dream I was having. But you must all look so wonderful today. And you're doing a great job. As she's swinging from the uh, the rigging and just swoops it beside you. Squawk! Thank you, Captain. Thank you. And I just give like a nice little salute. Uh, and what, what was Blood giving out? Uh, pies? Well, or? Yeah, some pie. As like they they pie. come over to you. Yeah, they they come over. Blah 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 blah. Fish pie, Captain. They hand Ooh, you. Thank you, my favorite. You're always doing such good cooking, blood. Thank you, Captain. Blah, 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 blah. As they squaddle away. And like as like um Flavia standing beside you. Shreleo is just uh just a few ticks to the to the south now. We're nearly there. Squawk! It's Almost time for a whole new adventure, gang. I can't wait to have a grand time with you. Aye, aye, Captain. We've already they had... All, they all shout. Had so many good times. And it's going to get so much better from here. As the... The tiefling... Sitting aboard some crates looks to like have like tears swelling in her eyes. As she nods at you. It'll be nice. Like you, you, like you, you've got to try samosas, Captain. They are to die for. And oh, I'm always to try a new food. Oh, it's oh, you, 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 you're gonna love it. Like you, you can get all sorts of fillings. You can, you can mix them all up if you want to. Like I'm pretty sure most, most samosa stalls nowadays would probably do that. My mom's, hmm, uh, I don't think we'll, we'll be able to stop, stop back, but uh, back home and so. She, but like maybe I can I can I can try get some some ingredients up and then like make some so you can so you can taste what like hers were like. That thanks for thanks like for be beautiful. Thanks for indulging indulging me, Captain. What what monsters do you think they got here? But maybe we'll find one like this rock that that we fought together. I don't know. I can add something to my to my outfit again. Oh, that'd be... Oh, maybe you'll be able to finish off the rock, Captain. Squawk! Uh, as um, Flavia swings by. Kill the rock! Kill kill the rock! Squawk! As Bonesog was away, as like, their lobster like starts uh, flapping. I think you'll uh, make a fine addition. Sorry, sorry, give me a second. I think you'll make a fine addition to your armor, Captain. <laughs> but I don't know what to tell you, man. Maybe, maybe we won't see rocks out, like... Hikari, Hikari, there. You were you were saying those stuff like called yokai and stuff and things like that, right? Yeah, no, yokai. Um, yeah, they're they're, they're what probably are uh, what we'll find most. But like, I mean, like dragons would be here. So they're, they're they're all over the place, and like, depending on where we are, on uh, we might find find something even even more more problematic or less. Who knows? But like, we we should we should we shouldn't try to try to get bungled up with anything that's uh, too problematic when we're trying to drop off these crates. Well, I'm sure whatever we... If we face anything like that, we can face it together and, uh, easily. Hmm. Just was in it, case. It was Isotor, wasn't it, Captain, that we, we were heading to? Yeah. Just dropping off the shipment. Hmm. We, might, we might find stuff there, then, I think. As I'm gonna just put you guys... You guys would be a bit... Or you be up around here-ish, or even like in the clouds, essentially. I'm gonna get rid of the squad for a second because they're not—they're not here. They don't exist in this in this time. Give me a second.
as you're taking everything in and like seeing some mountains on the horizon as the sun's beginning to beginning to rise not rise sorry it's beginning to set randall something something feel, feels eerie as i'm gonna ask you to roll me a perception check you got it captain Oh, okay, that's still good. 17. Just give me a second. I'm just going to change Discord server for a second to see if it helps. Is that right for you, Samba? Uh, I didn't hear anything. Okay, perfect. Like, it's all good. Everything's good for me. I uh, know. It's just, it's just a bit starry for me. I'm just trying to uh, fix the music as we go. Oh, the music? 17. Oh, yeah, the, the, the music for me is a, bit, is a bit stuttery. But as, like, your taking it all in you your um sorry you can hear this airy noise from underneath you something something below the waters as if something's like rearing itself, and you can f you can see the water begin to glow, purpley blue. As in just a sudden, as in a sudden eruption of wild magic. You are falling from the sky as as like the ship itself splinters and erupts around you. You yeah, you suddenly are free falling as your wings pull out just in the nick of time as you just crash land into some sand as you are on some random beach. The do sky. I, Sorry, go on. Do I get a sight of, of of anybody else? No. There is nothing around you except for sand. The the coast to your right. I'm gonna just do this actually. That's like the waves are com coming in. To your right, it's like some of like the tide is coming in a bit, and like it like just licks you. As you see above you, in a sky that is pitch black except for a green horizon, to the north west, you see a comet fly through the sky and crash land up ahead. That's like you see it. Something about it says you 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 want to you want to go towards it. But does Randall actually want to go towards it? I mean, first I I, I need to fight. Like if I if I'm not like like I I know I like flew and stuff a little bit, but if I'm not like tired enough or whatever, like like if I. If I feel up to it, I just want to look around for anything first, like possible, of any signs of anyone else before going off to that area. Sure. Yeah, I'm going to ask you to roll investigation as as you try like, scanning. I will even, like, dig in sand, even if they... Yeah. Uh, investigation, yeah, go ahead. Sorry. Yeah, investigation, please. That's going to be a fat nine. Mm-hmm. With that nine, time feels irrelevant as you're sk searching and scanning the beach wide. You've gone up as far as the coast allows you. Like you're, you are fairly exhausted after having crash landed. You go, you search the coast to the north, to the south. Yeah, like, like, I'm like shaking the whole time too. Yeah. Like I'm just as 
the air is silent, other except for the water crashing around and crashing to your uh, to the east. As as your um, as you start digging, it feels like hours pass, but the sand never moves. As like the further you dig, no lower into the sand do you go, and the sky around you never changes. Yeah, no, uh, at, at that point, tears in my eyes, I'll just get up and, uh, and sorry, it was, a uh, what, what was the, the, the distant sound, or? It was a comet, a flew overhead, yeah, and then, like, it crashed. Like, and crashed? It, yeah, it crashed, crash, okay. yeah, near you. Then, well, it looks relatively near you. And, uh, Okay. Can I roll like an arcana on it? Like, did yeah, it have? Course, yeah. Did it have like a vibe of 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 like anything with me? I don't know if that makes sense, but like, no, yeah, like you feel like no, some okay, attun- anything attunement to it. <laughs> no, but that doesn't four, stop you from four, wanting yeah. to go find out what it is. As like it is, dr- you are drawn to it. Whatever yeah, it is. I'll, uh... I'll make my way over to it if I if I can then yeah. Yeah. So uh how far away is it? It It doesn't matter how far away it is actually cuz like as like you Make you like start walking up the incline of the the beach onto like the weeds and the reeds and grass, um, the yellowy grass um, that like almost is like, illuminated like as if like the sun is hitting it, but like it's like white instead, like red and yellow. Um, as like time doesn't pass as you reach it, as you make your way uh, down to this this crashed comet. You you realize as soon as like you are in its aura, its magic radiate off it, you realize Rocky, Lo, Satoshi, Peaches, Hiryu are missing. And memory of them starts flooding over you as you're staring down at a Shiseki stone crashed into a bush of lavenders. A tiny bush of lavenders that like shimmers like a rainbow and its ripples are like streaks of the astral lights that you would see in the northern hemisphere of the planet. And when you look upon it, it is what you've been dreaming of, what you've hoped for and wished for. I I race towards this then if that's the case. <laughs> yeah. Like you you like by the time like like as you like you've been racing towards and like you've reached it and like that's like what like what you see and like that's the feeling you get when you look down at it. And it just like the air around it is warm but everything else is cold. And are these are the manifestations of these people physically there? No, it's just like you can sense like they're missing. But this Shiseki stone is what you need. Sorry, I didn't mean to click that button just then. The Shiseki stone is everything you dreamed of, hoped for, and wished for. I need it. You do. I'll, uh... I mean, if I... It, it, how big is this? It's, it, it, it's like, just like, just a bit bigger than, a, like, a, um... Or just a bit smaller than the palm of your hand. Oh, okay. 
Do you touch it? Yeah, absolutely. I grab it. I don't just touch it. Like, I'm going to, like, mm. attempt to pick it up and, like... Yeah, as you... Would, would it be correct in saying this greedily? Uh, hmm. yeah. I, I would... Yeah, in, like... Ah, uh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Self... Maybe, like... I don't know. It's hard. Yeah, yeah. Like, in, like, like a... Like, you're starved, almost, of, like, what this... The sustenance that this thing could provide, even. Like, it's, like... Yes. So it's not, yes, absolutely, yeah. yeah. Like, the, the greed you feel I isn't... Crave isn't it. Yeah, I crave. Yeah, you crave this... In, like, the most selfless way that, like, someone could feel. And as soon as your claw touches the stone... Everything around you just rewinds. As you are in the sewers. As I'm going to play this. Your feet are wet. As you yeah, you stand in the sewers of Kasakawa. You're a bit behind schedule. As Kuma, Ayumi, Goggle, Mozget are up ahead. While Eli, Tino... Uh, Zanatra and Akito are waiting in the rendezvous spot. But something's wrong. Something is very wrong as you can hear voices up ahead that are different to what your allies sound like. As mechanical footsteps of ACU can be heard echoing around the... um, around the sewers up ahead as you can hear screams of panic slashing and heavy splashing as bodies fall into the water and as you're hearing all this anguish a brick in the wall glimmers just like the shiseki stone you saw from earlier and like as you look at it as it shines on you illuminating the sewers around you it is what you've dreamed of, hoped for, and wished for. I take it, this time I take it, uh, like, sad, like, not even greedily this time, I take it sadly and, or aggressively actually in that sense, like, I, mm. I grab it almost like a punch. Actually, before you try to before punch the stone, I'm going to ask, how is Randall, how does Randall react to hearing all of those, um, the screams and the slashes? Just like he, he, like tears are streaming down his face, but like he is trying his best to just block it out because of just what he remembers about this all and... Mm. He, like he punches the wall almost as if to try to break through the wall to get his people to safety. Mm. But I, I, I feel like he knows it's kind of futile at this, at this point, and it's mm. we're going through it. As yeah, it's like you with the all the urgency you have in life to be as with the most selfless desire in your heart. You try to punch the stone out of the wall. And as, like, you're, you pry the stones around it and, like, feel like you can get a good grip on the stone. Once again. You find yourself in a different spot. As I'm going to play this. As you stand. Oh, this is not what I think it is. I'm going to... That was not the song I wanted, actually, even though that would have been pretty cool. Uh, I'm going to just find the thing that I'm looking for to give me a hot second. Uh, Ah, Here we are. Sorry. Sorry about that, Sam. Oh, sorry about that, Randall. As you stand in the center of a mech assembly room in 
the Kasakawa factory prison. Surrounded by strange machinery, alone. But for Raki, who is off the platform and it feels like a world apart. As his body smashes into the control panel on the side of the elevator. As he presses into the control panel, you see Sanyi, the giant lion mech, pounce onto Rocky. And as he pounces onto Rocky, in his mouth, this sun of gold blasts into uh, into Rocky's face as the elevator falls and the last thing you see of Rocky is him turning to gold like screaming no at this point as he's falling And as you scream that, once again, you fade into darkness. As I'm gonna do this. As now, you the like you blink, and you're rushing down scaffolding stairs. In the shadows of a giant mech surrounded in the same scaffolding that you're running down. As you can see a windowed room above you. As smoke is just eeping out of it. As electricity sparks from it. And in your head, you feel like you've done it. Rocky's set the bomb. But then you realize... Rocky doesn't have enough time to get out. And you look down, see the docks of the factory are full of ACU units. And at the heart of them, a beacon of fire. But a beacon of your doom. As Hikana, the fire genasi warden of the prison, looks up at you. As the explosion as the explosion goes off within the mountain and around you and you are flooded with a flash of light you don't even have a moment to think before another memory fades over you as I am going to do this. As your sword flashes by, as you just narrowly catch one of Rocky's katanas narrowly, dodging the second, as the factory around you is exploding. The ducks, the waves on the ducks are crashing around you. Compared to Rocky, how would Randall, how, how, how does Randall compare himself to Rocky as a fighter, is what I'm going to ask. Like, stylistically, or like, in but actual, in, like... in ability? Specifically ability, but like, if you, like, I'd also like, yeah, if you want to describe what this I looks just, like. I mean, I'm more like, finesse-based and like, elegant, whereas I feel Rocky might be more like, Samurai-esque, where it's like mm. just deliberate like strength-based moves. Yeah, like careful, and every every move is where it needs to be. Yeah, like get, Randall is like calculating his strikes mm. and stuff like that, pinpointing where like he would need to. Yeah, probably not striking as much, mm -hmm. but yeah, it's like you're trying to defend yourself against Rocky. How would you compare yourself, like in ability? Uh, probably comparable uh, to rocky yeah mm -hmm. like just keep keeping myself yeah. we're keeping each other on our toes pretty much yeah mm -hmm. you've both as, as fighters yeah like although like rocky rocky's been trained his entire life as into a, a warrior of sharia leo while randall you've had to fight 
and you've had to learn on the fly and improvisation and just your cunning is your is your is your strongest the sword. The sea was my master. Mm. And like the waves, you are striking at this unmoving boulder. And like as like your as you are trying to catch and just defend yourself in this moment, Rocky's betrayal stings deeper than anything else you've endured in this prison. Your friend. How, Why, how Rocky? He doesn't say nothing. As the betrayal can be seen on both of your faces, like the conflict is striking through his um, through his eyes, through tears, and in a blink, it's done. Your blade pushes through Rocky's chest, and I guess he was about to say something, maybe a, make a joke or some quip. His voice catches as he looks at you. I, I let go of the sword like immediately. Like it's still it still is punctured through him, but I mm. I let go. Mm -hmm. I'm I'm sorry, Rocky. He doesn't say a word as you see the life leave the Janassi. Uh yeah, I, I mean, I'll go down and, like, kind of hold him. If the place is still coming down around me at this it point, is. I feel as though I'd rather it just come down on me at this point. Mm -hmm. And as you're filled with this grief and anguish, the you see a rock shadow fall from above as it's about to crush you. As you close your eyes, you once again find yourself somewhere else. As, give me a second, you're standing on a plateau in, of stone on a beach. The same beach that you found that stone. The same beach where you met Rocky's friends in another time, in another life. And standing next to you, you feel a warmth. As standing next to you is a fire genasi in a gorgeous green sari and kimono mixed um, attire that like seems very traditional for Australia, but like you've. You've never seen something this beautiful or elegant in your in your life. As it's covered in chrysanthemums of white, red, and gold. As the green makes her eyes sparkle and come alive as they match match her dress. Her, her flame hair and elegant elegant and long and just waving around her, swirling around her, creating a radiance that is like the sun as it shines on you and her as you stand beside Hikana. Oh. You, you look lovely. Thank, thank, thank you. I, I, I didn't think it, it's been it's been so long since I've, I've had to wear something like this. Well, sh you should make it a more uh, often occasion. She smiled and gives a laugh. That'd be nice. As like you see Hikana. With the memories from the dreams that have happened around you, how how is Rocky feeling about it all right now? About uh, like everything that's just happened. 
and like, I mean, cause like this, like it's all it's just crashing like, into you, like the waves around you. Yeah, like I, the the weight of all these people that I've lost and what I potentially could have lost, and the, or this new timeline kind of vibe that I've, I don't know, like just it, it, Randall feels very, very, very devastated by it, and uh, but then coming into this, he's kind of, I don't know, he we. He wants to believe that this is truth and happiness, but he, you I don't know. He's always so distant about that kind of thing. He can't. I don't think he can believe that it actually is true. You want to roll insight to see if you can, with disadvantage, to see if you can betray yourself. Fourteen. Yeah, no. It feels off. And you hope that it's real. This is one of but those you... dreams that you wake up and you want to go back. Yeah. I'm I'm sorry. You just this is too perfect and thing things haven't been good enough for me lately that I can even believe that something like you is here for me. Why? Sometimes it can... Even when it's raining, sometimes the sun can shine through. Will you at least dance with me? If, if I can, I will. As she reaches out. I, I take her hand. And as time around you moves, this dance goes on for what feels like forever, but not enough time at the, as well. As you both just sway, she nestles her neck, I mean her head, in between your neck as her hair just swirls around you. And as it cradles you, you... Oh, I meant to do that, I think. <laughs> I was a bit too hasty there. That's okay. I am going to do this. As it cradles you. Yeah. It It was it was too it was too right. As none of that was real. As she starts shining like the stone. And in one last blink, you awake yourself on your ship again. Why is it not closing? Oh yeah. Sorry, roll 20's been a bit... You wake on your ship again. The, uh, what was it called again, sorry, uh, Randall? Uh, the Crystal Voyage. Give me a second. Being a little laggy. It is. This must be a hefty map. It is a hefty one, but um, I'm going to ping you over here. Get the fuck out. Don't say anything. <laughs> <laughs> I see. Is, it, is it better now, Sam? It's all solid. Everything's golden. Excellent. 
everything is all golden. Yes. As, <laughs> as you st stand aboard, what was the ship called again? Sorry, I, I zoned out. Crystal Voyage. As you're standing above, uh, uh, on the crow's nest of the Crystal Voyage, silence surrounds you. Sorry, I'm going to run away. No, there's no about it. Give me a second, as I gotta change something. Swan dive. As you're on the, uh... The crow's nest. Silence around you, as the ocean just takes the ship forward. As, like, it's been repaired from that climactic surge of wild magic. However, your crew... Wasn't so lucky. As... Their bones have reinforced the ship, create a exoskeleton around the Crystal Voyage. As you also see the skeletons of everyone you've crossed um, in some way upon stepping on Shireleo's shores. Every single skeleton that makes the bones of this ship you could name. As you can hear the voices of Satoshi, Kano, Loniko, Suika, and Peaches. Who I will also know. It's like you look down at your crew. All of them look as you remember them. Except for Peaches, who's grown up. She looks to be in her teenage years. Still, she's eating on a peach as she's helping around the uh, the ship. As you look down at your your skeleton crew, ahoy, mateys! Ahoy, captain! Ahoy, captain! How are the seas today? Little choppy, I've got to say. But always great with you on them. Couldn't agree more, Captain. Where are we off to today, Navigator? Suika uh, opens up. Halakis, Halakis, Captain, Captain. Off we go. Correct, yes? Well, we're going home then. Your home, maybe, maybe. But we're happy to see, see. Suika says, as they make their way over to Rotten's would be happy, happy to, to show you guys. Satoshi gotcha. sitting atop the uh, the cannon. Peaches um, also beside them. You've, as they've joined your crew, Randall, um, the child has grown to see you all as parental figures but Satoshi obviously uh, having spent the most time with, with them has been um, she is almost like looks at them like a mentor um, and she just gives you a smile and gives you a nod as um, as your Kano so you wanted to say something continue no no, no there, was, there, was, there, was, there was nothing more to that uh, no, no, I'm just, if you have more to say. <laughs> I do not. How about Lo Nico? I got it. So, Captain. <laughs> yes? You're heading home, yes? Seems like it, yeah. Do you have anyone waiting for you? Um, hopefully, I mean, it's been a while since I've been home, so hopefully my family is still there. I haven't seen them in a long, long time. Anyone you're sweet on, you're waiting for. No, no, I have. I didn't have anyone when back at home home, no. That's a shame. I've lost uh, people like that too, uh. There's nothing like true love, you know? 
back in my home, I have a, I have a wife, you know. Really? Yeah. I think you know her, Moran. What? What? <laughs> hey, you had to so surprised, Captain. Captain, that we've, been married for, we've been married for 15 years, Captain. I think the air might have been too thin up in the closeness, Captain. I I sit down. Everything, oh, everything all good, Captain? Captain? Satoshi shouts. Yeah, it's all great. It's all great. Everything's wonderful, actually. Sure, I can throw my turd some smelling salt if you want. You look a little, a little daisy. I'm just breathing, like, very heavily. <laughs> Lonika comes back with an orange. Thank, thank scurvy, you, Lonika. Fight the scurvy, There's Peaches shouts. Here. <laughs> just getting a little that seasickness here, maybe. <laughs> oh. You look a little, little ghostly. Are you all right? I could say the same thing. I think he looks a bit rocky, personally, Satoshi Shirt. <laughs> but where is, huh? where is Rocky? Where's who? Ooh. Captain, I think you might need to lay down. Yeah, no, like, uh, yeah. You sure you've been getting some sleep, Captain? Peaches, go, 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 go get the chief a bed. As Peaches rushes off. And starts looking for a, uh, and a bed just kneels down next to Randall and like puts the back of her hand on his forehead. <laughs> I lay I lay a hand on his shoulder, but it's like gold and heavy and just weighs him down. <laughs> Tink. <laughs> I appreciate the concern, my my friends. It's been a hell of a journey till now, huh? Apparently so. And like under my breath, like I, I would have loved to have been there for it. Perhaps you're just excited and nervous to return home, Captain. I hope that's what this is. I love, I love you all, and you've made this trip, you've made my life amazing. I need you to know that, regardless of what happens. <laughs> well, life on the sea, you know. You've given us something I don't think I've ever had before, or a true freedom. <laughs> we know all too well, Captain. Thank you all for saving me. Uh, you and me as well. As your sharing your your endearments for one another you hear the the sky rip open as a meteor a comet shoots across the sky cutting it in half as it goes in the direction you're going to as randall home becomes a second thought in this moment as seeing seen that comment you know what it is it's everything you've hoped for dreamed of and wished for but i have that right here and yet you know something is off I know. Your body and your Captain? brain betrays itself. Yes, Lo. Is everything okay? Every everything is just great, Lo Nico. And as you just say, a emotional. The journey's coming to an end. Oh yeah. As There'll be others. They're saying that. We'll always be here. You feel you miss them so much, and you need that comet, Randall. I I hug everyone super tightly.
I'm I'm sorry. I have to go. We understand. It's been a pleasure serving with you. And you too, Kano. You too. I give him a salute and like smack my forehead with my gold hand. <laughs> <laughs> Just takes his own head off. <laughs> and am I... Are we taking this whole ship, or do I'm, uh, am I walking off? Like, do I... Am I overboarding? You're the do captain. That, that kind of draw. Like, I mean... It, I mean, well, so, like, it's... I, it's too far for you to swim, you reckon? As, like, the waves okay, are... Okay. The waves are going, but, like, it's not... It's racing across the sky. So like you, 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 you know you have control of the ship. So like you, even if your body can't chase it, there's still a chance if you wish. All right, we're we're changing course then to the meteor. The aye, aye, captain, captain. Speaker shouts as long as along with Satoshi uh, and along with Satoshi and uh, Peaches, but they don't obviously. Uh, mirror echo themselves and as like the ship starts to move you can see the you can hear the anchor uh being um pulled up and you feel a ship moving across the waves as it rocks up and down the clouds don't move and you've been on the ocean to snow when like the ship feels like it's moving and like it's physically moving but this is like when you're running in a dream. And although... Anymore. Everything around you is moving like it would be. You can tell the ship is going nowhere. As muffled voices can be heard from underneath the ship. I'm going to ask you to roll me a perception check. And if Randall, uh, I'm low on Kano want to listen, they can as well. 23 perception. Mm -hmm. I, may, I may have to fly, my friends. As you hear, you can hear it clear as day what the voices under the water are saying. But the bones are whispering too. As you hear, everyone you cross. Anyone you consider close always ends up dead. And you will always be alone, Randall. As you can hear, the water get disturbed. As the boat feels like it, something grabs it. And as it's being grabbed, you see... I'm going to pull you guys over here, and you're going to need to scroll back to your positions. I'm going to put this over here. As you can see, pulling Captain. on the ship, as it's gone, Fuck. gone, gone. <laughs> as you see, crawling out of the water, or it's the it's skull breaking the water first. Give me a second. Holy shit! <laughs> as you see, Randall, the monument of your sins. Climbing out of the water, made of m thousands and millions of bones, joined together into a giant skeleton as it pulled itself out of the water, covered in green ethereal fire, as in the hollows of the uh, 
in the hollows of the um, the skeleton, you can see black voids that form into the target eyes of yokai as green fire erupts from its eyes and it looks down at you randall and you feel it piercing right into your soul do you feel the weight of all of us crashing on you randall sidio as millions of voices can be heard ringing through you. I feel that weight every day. As we are going to take a quick little break. If that's okay with you guys. No, let's keep going. <laughs> <laughs> as I'm going to stop the uh, stress and boat sounds. But yeah, we are going to be back in about five, ten minutes. Um, you guys, if you're watching the VOD or just watching us live, hi, how you doing? I hope you guys are uh, vibing. Yeah, <laughs> Frankie, Gasha de Kuro, dab in chat, please. Um, but yeah, we, uh, I want to shout out Two Minute Tabletop for the, uh, the bone assets for, uh, for this token, as it's not one I've drawn. This is physically made out of the metal assets bone. I use. A lot of bones. Nice. But yeah, we are going to take a quick break. Um, so grab some water, do some star trips or something. I will be back in five or ten hot minutes. And we're going to throw a quick pre-roll just after we leave so that anyone in chat that jo or anyone new that joins will have... Um, we'll have a what's it called. We'll have no ads uh, for the first half hour of like when we return. So see you guys in a hot second. Oh, also, before we go, I uh, want to thank uh, everyone that entered this uh, 2023's uh, um, Task Poster Challenge. We will be picking the win winners after the stream and then reaching out uh, to everyone that's won after. And well, you might have seen everyone's posters for this year at the beginning of the stream, and you might see them on the next panel. I can't remember where I put it there. Um, but yeah, you can see in the Discord. Uh, so if you haven't already joined the Discord, you should. But yeah, we'll be back in about five, ten-ish minutes. See you guys in a second. See where I come from, people never make it out. I'm a five star brain in a two star town. And I'ma give it back when I have enough money in my hands. Enough for the friends and the fam. And I owe it all to Yahweh. Lord knows that I couldn't do it my way. Almost bought a ticket for the fast lane. Now I'm hopping on a flight to the epiglades to forget the pressure.
How can you see the health bar? I can't. I'm lying. I can't. Oh, you asshole. You tricked me. I can't see the health bar. I definitely cannot see the health bar above its head. Alright, give me a fucking guy. Oh, sweaty. Are, are we live? Yeah, we're live. Are we now, live? Sorry. Yeah, we're live. We're back in. We're not, we're, not, we're not gonna talk about this. <laughs> 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 you gotta let me know, man. Sorry. Oh, I see why. There we go. Oh. Yeah, this thing pulls itself out of the water. And as it's pulling stuff. itself oh, wait, out, Jesus. you can see the waters start to sink. As like, once again, you hear that noise. But along with it, you just hear like the collapse of the world weave and then just glitches as the waves fall in on themselves as they start sinking into a black hole. As the Gashidakaru is going to trying to make its first attack at you all. As it comes closer, pulling itself in into the ship. It's going to do this. Grabbing a hold of the ship. It comes in as close as it can. Ah! And as it like looks down on you all, I'm going to just do this. I'm going to ask you all to make me a dexterity saving throw, please. That I can do. Oh, one second. Let me. Oh, oh, one second. Have no fear. The dexterity check king is here. <laughs> you roll so a fucking one now. Don't, don't. Don't. Okay. Wait. Okay. Uh, wait, hold on. Let me knock on wood. Hold on. My roll twenty is is a uh, saving throw. Or... Rolling. Yeah. Saving throw, please. Yeah. Oh, now I'm gonna look like a jackass. No matter what I roll, it's gonna be stupid. Plus seven, plus six. Oh! Are you fucking kidding me? I'm done! We're out of here! Game over, people! This is stupid! Ah, this is dream! I'm running on- I'm running in sludge! This is bullshit, everyone else gets such a good- This is a dream, this is- That's how you know it's a dream. I'm sorry, oh, Lonico. They don't work here. Oh. Actually, I will allow it, but I'll allow it, but not for not for this nat one. I know you don't like me doing it for that. No, 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 no. Oh, I do. I, I, I don't mind no. it. It's specifically this one moment. I think. Not. I think. I know. That sucked. Because, Randall. So, let's, what's eight times six? Is what I'm gonna ask everyone. Eight six times what? Eight times six. That would be thirty-six. That's that right. I'm just kind of guessing. I I threw that. I threw a shot in the dark. Was that right? That is forty-eight. Fuck! That's exactly your hit points. That's exactly how much. By the way, you were all a long rest. <laughs> Peaches. Uh. Ah. Peaches. <laughs> You just yell, Peaches! <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> Peaches get oh. flung off. Peaches! <laughs> Randall, you immediately just f collapse as you hit I'm zero. Out, guys. You're out. Oh boy. Wow. <laughs> it's his fuck. He's the main <laughs> character of this dream. <laughs> Where's my dead Can face? There's my, I'll use my fucking. shot. Oh! Bone, you die in the dream, you die in the real. Yeah. <laughs> I will also note, chat, you can help or hinder this fight using your channel point reactions. Help! <laughs> How much more could you hinder Randall's fucking dead? I'm dead, dead <laughs> man. As you, Kano, say that part? you take 15 damage <laughs> as you go to, like, block with your golden fists. And as, like, you are blocking Lone Nico and, um... Or helping, um shield as much of the party as you can this like kind of like curves around you 
as if it's almost targeting Randa as like this fiery uh, flame in its mouth just gets thrown at the ship and just erupts around you all. As low, you also take. <laughs> Holy crap. You take 15 damage, low Nico, as I am just struggling to like be able to like even do anything on World 20 right now. Th thank you for clipping that. <laughs> oh, was it clipped or was it? It's been clipped. Thank you, thank you, Frankie. I'm sorry, I cursed oh you. Oh my god. <laughs> What's a touch? That's a beautiful. What are the chances, man? As yeah. <clears throat> it's just, yeah. Throws this fiery. Um, this f just green, necrotic, evil fire of you all. As it, like, crashes into the ship, you see a flash random before you get knocked unconscious. Oh, this is awkward. Like, you guys can see underneath them. Uh. Hmm? Give me a second, or I'm going to just do this. Yeah, Sorry, Roll20 no, like, is, no. is, is having a time with itself. As, like, the green fire flashes over, blood is just seen all over the ship. As you can see, the bones that you may not have noticed at the, fr uh, the front of the ship and have littering all over the, uh, the deck are, um, are covered in bones, Randall. I mean, in blood, sorry. If I, yeah, I mean, I'll, uh, before I get, get knocked out, I mean, a single teardrop falls from my eye. <laughs> <laughs> as much as uh, sadness as I can convey about that before, bleh, I, I'll do that. Mm -hmm. Holy. There we go. Sorry, I know the ship's just... I'm sorry, I'm sorry, everybody. The ship's just moving... Rocking, rocking and rolling. Uh, but yeah, they're going to pass their turn over to you, Rocky. You mean Randall? Randall, sorry, yeah. Sorry, my mistake. Randall's Wait, I have a turn? You have a turn. You have a death save. Oh, okay, fair enough, fair enough. <laughs> you got me there. <laughs> oh! Oh. <laughs> what is this? That's two it's fails. Oh what is my life? I am going to allow low one of your ripples to affect this if you would like to. Hmm? Oh, I would like you to use. Lock? I would allow. I I will allow happily allow low's um. What's it called? <clears throat> Uh, foresight. Gipto's eye? Yeah, that's the one. Which one would you like to give to? It's above a 10 for a death save, right? It is, yeah. So it's either or will succeed. You can have my 14. <laughs> you succeed, a... Randall. Okay, thank God. Thank you, love. As <laughs> you see the Thumbs universe. Up, I'm going to... <laughs> you see the universe around you collapse as like you're like you hit the ground and as soon as like you hit the ground you hear that noise once again amongst reverberations of lone nico's jingles as you are back up standing as but as you are standing the world around you s sinks into a never-ending void of space what the hell as comets around you are seen just flying uh, forwards, racing around you. As the Gashid Akira watches them all. And then looks back down at you all. Who would you like to pass your turn to, uh, Randall? Uh, I'll, I'll pass my turn to Low. Low, it's your turn. My coming, Captain. <laughs> <laughs> right, uh, 
I will um, upcast kill wounds mm -hmm. on Randall. Let's heal him up. Nine plus four, that is thirteen. As low this ever beacon of warmth and loyalty, Randall. Her bells jingle all around you as you get this warmth to fill you up. As you are able to pick yourself back up. As uh as Lois cast cure wounds on you. Anything Stay else? Stay with us, Captain! I'm trying! Captain! Yeah! <laughs> I can see! <laughs> I have good <laughs> inspiration to Kano. It's yours, Kano. I get inspiration? I'm inspired. You oh, are, no, it's like no, a little no, fox no. flies over to you and gives you. Alright, I'm gonna. Run up oh, here. body of inspiration. I'm gonna oh, use no. one key point to cast Radiant Sunbolt twice. Oh, wait, one mm -hmm. second. Uh. Uh. uh Let's see. Oh no, fuck my body inspiration is. Oh, that is that one. Do I have a... I... Oh, here we go. There it is. Bam. And the second one? Bam. Do those hit? They do hit if you want to describe Kano's Radiant Sunball... Uh, sunball I'm gonna... Right where the mass is here, I'm gonna do like a... Like a like, I'm gonna climb up a little bit and then I'm gonna blast one and as I jump off and do a flip, I'm gonna blast the other one. Mm-hmm. Yeah, like they just crash into the gash of the car. And like this radiant light, as it blasts off the bones, you see them start to crumble and break and melt under the light. As it turns down to you, Kano. And then you see some skeletons on its arm all point to Kano. Look at one that you have taken to death. Look how he still fights for you. And I'll do it again, motherfuckers. <laughs> Anything else, Kana? <laughs> no, that's it. <laughs> that's love. Would you like to pass it to watermelon or peaches? Uh, let's go peaches. All right. Peaches running up to you. Like this, Kano uh, Peaches uh, says, as she just swirled around the mast and then fires her fists turn into these spectral golden fists. And she launches two sunbolts of her own. Oh! Oh, not two, sorry, one. Oh. But as, like, she, <laughs> like... <laughs> as she climbs up the mast and tries to, like... Uh, mimic you, she slips and you, she just falls into your arms as you like uh, land. Maybe not like that. Hello. As she is now over yeah, here. Want, needs a better balance on your feet. Yeah. And she's going to pass it over to Suika, who is going to rush over, pulling out their katana, and is going to rush over to the nearest finger they can. And then just headbutt it with its watermelon head. Ooh. No, it ain't it. As the head smashes into the wood, as like the bones fall apart, um, and you see Sweeker's head just like kind of crack, and watermelon juice starts spilling out of it. Oh! As the bones realign themselves back into each other, and then form back into a giant finger. As Suika is going to try again with two slashes of their katanas, they still have a... Uh, they still have the turn action. Oh shit! That hits! As the first one misses and catches the bone, the second one is very carefully... Uh, carefully uh, pinpointed and slices away at one of the bones, dealing 13 damage.
it is now. Uh, Suika is going to go again, but then they're going to pass the turn over to, to, to Randall. I think they'll go for two Katana strikes one more time. Now that's what I'm talking about, baby. <laughs> <laughs> So it yep. just does like a slice, slice, and just sloshes. Yeah, just, like, just yeah, like in like just like a spill <laughs> of what in a spray of watermelon juices, the uh, the yokai is just slashing away at the uh, at the yokai. Did I do the headbutt? I don't think I did. did. However, the headbutt, as soon as it like smashes into the yokai, it's devastating, as it like cracks and breaks one of the finger bones completely. Ow. And then I'm gonna pass it turn over to you, Randall. Alright. Are you on your death save still? I'm, oh, I'm, 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 I'm up. I'm up, I'm up. Oh yeah, you are. Sorry, sorry, my mistake. I'm not, I'm not dying today. Oh. Not today. But I did accidentally open up Firefox. Never do that. <laughs> Georgia okay. with her Firefox browser. <laughs> well, you know what yeah, I right. mean. Chrome in that case for her, but. <laughs> uh, 5, 10, 15. Nope. I use Opera GX. 25. Hey. Is this in range or do I have to be in the next. in the finger here? Like, is, is, is this fine or. Go for it. Like, you know, but, like, you know what I mean? Like, is, is this fine right here? Because I want to be beside you still. Oh. Give me a second. Like, I, I'm... Because, like, his finger is in that square, kind of. I just... Yeah, no, yeah, you'd be able to get it. Like, his finger's, I'm like, a to hole go. clutching so... onto, like, the rib cages of the ship. Perfect. Let's just go for... Some... As, like, cage. you get close to them, Randall, all the bones oh, no. are just echoing and repeating themselves in very hushed, muffled tones. Monument to your sins. Then it has to be me to tear it down. Come on, man. Alas. Oh. Mans! I don't actually, I don't think I have extra attack, actually. So like... you know, it doesn't matter, because like, I was like, either neither one would have hit. As you go to slash, one of the skeletons comes out of the finger and grabs your sword and pushes Ooh. it away. You sent me to the sewers, Randall. You sent me to die. That skeleton shouts at you. Jesus. Anything else, Randall? I disengage uh, as a uh, bonus action with uh, the rogue feature. Uh, and I just get behind Kano. Mm -hmm. Oh. I cannot move. I forgot Satoshi had a turn. I was wondering. I thought so. I, I <laughs> thought something was fishy there. Some fella missed their turn. Some idiot forgot it. Okay, so I continue. Uh, and then I will. I'll get Kano. I'll, I'll start doing my uh, camera. What the feature's called, but my advantage to Kano. Start smashing Kano. Do your best. And then you get an advantage on your next turn. Yeah, and I'll pass it to you. But only on the first, the first attack. So right here was good. Oh, yeah, but you can like uh, right yeah on my yeah the, the yeah. one one thing oh. over here. Oh, yeah, look right there. Wait, Wait. I have a baby now. <laughs> <laughs> I am baby. There we go. Okay. I am uh, become baby. And I'm gonna do two on our um our, 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 oh my god unarmed strikes. Go ahead. Uh, bam, bam. Uh, oh, wow. and then, uh, they hit. That was one attack and bonus action flurry of blows. Oh, so two more. Holy the shit. Last one doesn't hit, sadly. That's oh, right. shit. Fuck it now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. 
That's all yeah, right. bludgeoning. You you I, know it's for the skeleton that was fucking mocking him. I just think yeah, fucking one two three right in the face. Like it explodes on the first one, but each punch after that just turns it into dust. As your bludgeoning strikes are devastating to the bones as they crumble against your golden fists. And then that would be my turn. I'm going to pass it off to the skeleton itself. Mm -hmm. I'm going to ask everyone to roll me a wisdom save. As the Gashtakara oh. is just emanating its aura off of itself as like its evil bitter sadness emanates off it and oh yeah for the the fellas uh, Suica this is Peach and this is Satoshi Randall Kano and Satoshi fail as you three have this fr it's frightening pe presence shadow you all and like as like that the evil um dust fade off of the uh out of, out of the ether you see one skeleton Kano that comes off and even though it's just bones you can tell it's Moran And Bye -bye. <laughs> you can see sadness in the bones as like she doesn't say anything but like she watches you attempt to attack as you are now frightened Randall it's difficult to have to have like this All this linger in your head and just take form into literal skeletons of the millions that could have possibly died within Kasakawa. How, how do you feel, Randall? As Satoshi is just like panicking. Fucked up. Uh, <laughs> I. Uh, yeah, I feel just emptiness inside me, just with like, especially after just getting that one guy to my face, pretty much after I failed the attack. Uh, that's pr I'm just hearing the echoes of it all in my head. Like as like that's replaying in your head, the sounds of the comets around you, flying around you, emanate that s shimmering noise as they continue to fly around you. They start to sink in and curl in as the void starts falling once again in on itself. As the gash of the car is falling in, sinking in. As it pulls itself away from the ship for a moment. As it starts falling into the void, but so is the ship. I'm on the ropes. <laughs> it starts falling into the void. And you just see all the comets start to like collapse in on them and start going into this void as well. As the ship is starting to like under you feel the underneath of the ship starting to like collapse and like rip apart. As it is going to try and make an attack. It's try me, bitch. Yeah, it's gonna try, and it's one of its fists is gonna fly towards Kano, and the other is gonna fly towards the Suica. As it just pincers the ship and just slams both its fists into its side. This is for Kano. 
No. This is oh. Suiko. Wow, as the spectrum. The bones Shit smash bug. into the rib cage on the side of yours, Kano. But the other side erupt as bones start flying everywhere. As the Gashidakar smashes its giant fist into the Suika Abaka's uh, body. As it takes 17 damage, as it gets squished like a fruit. Or it's what you can hear the watermelon like cracking under the force of the, uh, the yokai. And then it's going to pass its turn over to low. Okay. Uh, is Suika fucking dead? No, he's still, he's still up. Yeah, he's... really. I'm up. up. Suika shouts. Okay. How is he uh... looking though? Like he's half of the fucking watermelon <laughs> like gone? Like, how is no, he no, he's, he's still like... <laughs> he has real face. <laughs> it's a smaller Other watermelon. Hands... <laughs> Other hands on the ship again? Yeah, no, no, they've just... One's like smashed into Suika, the other... Is like stuck on the rib cages on the side. So actually, good point. But one is uh, on the ship here. Um, and can I use my banana leaf fan here? Randall, have you ever seen Lo use her banana leaf? I used it in the fight with Argosco. Yeah, oh shit! I feel Go like ahead. Yeah, no, if yeah. you've seen him. Yeah, then yeah, you. you... Uh... Sorry, I, I, I don't, I don't, I don't know the continuity of my own, uh, my own campaign. Sometimes. The continuity. <laughs> yeah, I don't even know English. Fine. I'm not from here. <laughs> okay, uh, I kind of remember where I just measured. Uh, okay. <laughs> if I use the banana leaf fan, can I cast a bonus action spell because it's a magic item, or does it count as me casting a spell? I'm gonna count. Yeah, I'm gonna count as not casting a spell with the with the fan. Okay, cool. Uh, I will not have it hit the speaker. Uh, but the uh, big guy needs to make a con save. Big guy. This guy thinks he's clever making a, making a jawbone a fibula. Look at that. Huh? Wow. <laughs> Fuck you, man. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? Randall's it dead again. It looks really good. It looks. Just, I love it. I noticed it just now. I was like, oh wow. Um, oh, they take they take half damage. Okay. Yeah. Um. Does it roll another con save for the exhaustion thing, or is that the same con save? Yeah, I'm same over here save. thinking that's a fibula. Same con save. Bones are. <laughs> uh, I'm going to. Do I want to use silvery bombs? Kind of. <laughs> the one wave in the fan casting heat wave an eruption of heat. So yeah, like as like you wave I mean, radius the fan. Bomb, Fire just erupts out of you as like this wave of fire just flies. You were using it right, sorry. Am I right in saying that? Yeah, I am using it. I'm wondering if I want to use silvery barbs on the thing they did on the saving roll. They did. Ah, I see. You can if you want to. <laughs> Do it. Yeah, why not? <laughs> Fuck them up. Ahead, we're, in, we're in no man's land, Roll it right? again. <laughs> Roll it again. As chat, I'd like to remind you, you can help or hinder. Like, if I'm getting beat up and you think, like, that it's too easy for all oh, them. Oh, what? You, should, you, should help. You, should, you guys should help. Oh, like, yeah. oh, wow. Look at that. Take that fucking Dude, exhaustion. Did you hear how she said that, too? If you think I'm getting beat up. That <laughs> gives me a magic item. Also, oh, my God. Uh, why are you beating up my thing? Yeah. Oh. As this eruption of fire. Emanate off of uh, off of uh, Lonico. As I'm gonna give you a little uh, radius of 15 feet. As you now have a heat There's wave. Also, uh, layer actions that people can use. There are good point. Actually, I'll, I'll, I'm gonna let you use a major if you want to. As a thank you. As a member of chat. What the hell? What the hell, Frankie? 
We thought we were homies. Thank I was getting you world driving. cakes. <laughs> Frankie, if you'd like to roll me a D10, please. As I will describe what your uh, your healing spirit looks like. As yeah, um, that 10 becomes 20 as the fire chars some of the bones. Like as it's charring some of the bones, you can see white Are you fire. Fucking kidding me! <laughs> like, thank you, Frankie, but like, why is it? It's cursing. There's so many me. ones yeah. today. What is this? Roll me a D hundred, oh Sam. My. I'm gonna ask you. Roll me a D hundred. <laughs> oh man! Because it's, it's your dream. Let's let's see. Let's see if like the universe or if your uni internal universe it's is fucking wide. nightmare at the moment. Yeah. He hates himself. That's why. Wait, okay, wait. D one hundred ninety-five. You fail. I'm sorry. You only get one hit point. What the fuck? As I'll describe it in a second. As this needed a one hundred. <laughs> really? Wave, <laughs> this wave chars the bones on uh, on the finger of the uh, uh, the yokai, and as it's charring, Rocky, you can see okay. it's. Okay, no. Uh, so, no, no, it's Randall. Sorry, Randall. I'm saying, I'm sorry. Yeah, in my in my defense, <laughs> Piper just messaged me. Oh, as yeah. <laughs> we're the gem boys, we're the mineral. Yeah, the mineral, boys. the mineral boys. As, uh, the spectrum. as like they char, you can see, like it's almost like a visage of the explosion within Kasakawa. As like the, those those finger bones start charring from the heat wave, as it takes twenty damage. As hey, hey. a star, as it's like falling out of the sky, it breaks off and flies towards you. And as it hits you, you get one hit point back. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> back to the face of the rock. He Anything? Was... It was rocky. Anything else, low? Um, no, because I used my bonus action to cast silvery bobs. Um, no, well, technically that's a reaction. But... I appreciate you, Frankie. Actually, no, Silvery Buzz is a reaction, so I still have yeah, a bonus reaction. Yeah, it's reaction, so you still have a bonus action. Oh, great times. Um, I will, <laughs> I will cast Healing Word on Randall. Uh, oh, I appreciate You guys, you love me, I feel it. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> hey, what is this? This is lying. This is a- you've done something. I cast Punch Randall in the face. And, and then you're gonna get a nasty <laughs> funny, like that's- <laughs> Wake up! This is dream bullshit! Yes. As Randall heals by five hit points from uh, Lo Nico's healing words, I was like, her words- As you say, yeah, you feel the love from your allies in this moment. <laughs> Even if it wasn't the most healing that it could be. Oh, I need to give advantage to someone from Silvery Bombs. You can't even give it. No, sir. <laughs> uh, I will give Randall advantage from the Silvery Bombs. Thank you. We'll um, see what happens here. And also the uh, Gashidro fella. Uh, yeah, Gashidro can't take uh, bonus Kuro. actions. Yeah. Mm -hmm. No bonus actions for him. No, all, no my bonus fire action. all my damage is fire damage. I will mm -hmm. remember that. Uh, I am. Done. Who's left? Suika. Sorry, not Suika. Peaches and Satoshi. Give it to Satoshi. Just remember, guys, all fire damage, or all damage can be fire damage if you punch them with with the torch. <laughs> <laughs> As Satoshi is going to, you 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 see the signature move, Randall. You've seen them do it countless times. As they grab a crate and then just pulling it in front of them, launch it with catapult as like it's like a physics gun. As a rush of wind erupts off the the crate as it flies towards the yokai. Oh, nice! They've got to be eleven. I'm pretty sure there are peaches in that crate, but okay. <laughs> oh no! As you see them erupt into peaches. Peaches just gets. Just super upset. Reverting back to like a childhood yeah. state and just crying pretty much. Although it like erupts. <laughs> yeah, Peach just starts crying. No! As it erupts no! off the, the bones, it doesn't seem to affect the skeleton. As you just hear them all just start to cackle <laughs> with laughter. And even the pile of bones on the ship start laughing. As Peaches. I caught it, Captain! Sorry, I mean, is it. 
Captain Satoshi, as she rushes over to the cannon and like just turns it around. Oh, that's his arm. Shoot Suiko. <laughs> <Kills him. laughs> Shoot him right in the fucking back. <laughs> Load him into Get the in cannon. cannon. It's perfect. Yeah. As she just starts trying to pull it back as well as she's doing that to uh to like get is the there. baby doing this what yeah no the yeah, baby's so, like so she's, she's, she's like normal normal age normal yeah, age. she's like <laughs> just teenage in this in this situation get in the cannon baby <laughs> as she is going to need to roll give me a second baby in the cannon <laughs> as the gas the car is going in the cannon so <laughs> Oh, yeah. Roll a deck save. I think it should roll the damage. It should. Excellent. Whoa. It's got to roll a deck save. Uh, DC 10. It fails as Whoa! the skull has just this, an eruption from the cannonball as it flies through the air. And it's a giant peach when you see the cannonball as it flies towards the yoke and smashes it into its skull. Dealing 30 damage as it smashes it into one of the eyes and the eye just starts erupting with fire. As it, and as it does that, Randall, the fires shift to that of white fire and lightning. As it almost, the cracks in the bones look like that of the mountains of Kasakawa after its eruption. But not only the eruptions of the mountain, but the wreckage of your first ship. The Obsidian Voyage. Or was it the Obsidian? Oh, the Crystal Voyage, sorry. The Crystal Voyage, yeah. The Crystal Voyage, as you look at the Wreck of Bones. As Peaches is gonna go again. And once again, gonna fire the cannon. And continue wheeling it back upwards. Fire! It's pulling like the A team thing where it's making our ship like fly backwards. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> or, or, like, in the yeah, that is, it, it's, like, yeah, it's not actually like <laughs> it's not actually Peaches like pulling it back, it's like the recoil is pushing her back. <laughs> and like actually like it is getting pushed back by the recoil. This time the cannibal flies past the cracks where she first aimed. And then once again it starts cackling with laughter. As she's gonna pass her turn to you, Randall. Um, and sorry, am I feared? What was the demon face? You're frightened, but you can on the end of your turn. Give me a second. End of my turn, okay. So I make all my attacks with disadvantage, right? Give me a second. Yeah, at the end of the turn, you gotta roll a. Uh... A wisdom saving though, DC 15. Yeah, you can't run towards it. Okay, you can't, okay. But you can, like, your attacks, you can still make attacks and stuff. I don't really have a whole lot of rain. I mean, I can, okay, look. Excuse me, Peaches! You want the cannon, Captain? Yeah, give me a shot. Go ahead. You've got the cannon in your uh, character sheets. You can, you can click cannon. And then it's got to roll a DC 15. Oh, I do have cannon. It fails to see how much damage you do to it. Oh, shoot. No worries. As, where are you aiming? Where's, where are you aiming the cannon? Straight for the head. Yes, it flies towards the skull, smashing into it. It deals 26 damage. As it just erupts off of the yokai, as like the top half of the skull is gone now, and it is just a, t a set of a, a, like an upper jaw and a lower jaw, and like the uh, outline of like where its eyes would sit. As it just looks down and starts cackling once again. Why would you send us to our deaths, Randall? To kill us again? It shouts at you. Or they shout at you. As it looks down towards you all. Randall, anything else? Uh, I will 
I'm gonna instruct Watermelon to um, slash as best he can to get its hands off of the ship. Aye, aye, Captain. Captain. And I'll, pass it, I'll pass it to Watermelon, yeah. yeah. You're gonna roll for your fear. Yeah, What's you're gonna roll. Oh, Wisdom save, please. Thank you for doing that. You should have advantage from the Body. silvery bulbs. Yeah. Because you didn't oh, make an Lanta, attack roll. Why, why are you lagging? Yeah, not. Oh, oh! That succeeds. <laughs> Shit! Oh my god, what just happened? <laughs> and as... It succeeds. No, I, I went from being like, af like afraid to now I'm like even more afraid, if I'm being honest. Yeah, no good. Because even like now your fear is instead of like at the Gashtakaro, you feel like you're free falling as the ship descends downwards and like you're plummeting into a black hole as once again the comets swirl around you, flying around you all. As how does that, how does uh, Lonico and uh, Kano react to this? As Peaches is like struggling to hold onto like a crate and like whatever she can, the Rob Satoshi clutching onto uh, onto the crystal crates as well. Suika holding onto the side. What what Lo and Nakano doing as uh, the ship is collapsing or free falling into this void? Uh, I, I whip up my loot and start playing Black Hole Sun. <laughs> Roll performance. Black Hole Sun. <laughs> She would be casting for the ball, but she's used her reaction this round. Yeah. So even though it's falling, you are actually oh. like you. You're that's still a bomb, that's a like dice. level. That's fucking and weird. Sadly, with your six, <laughs> with your six on that performance, you pull out a loop, but you can just hear like Kano like struggling to strum this loop as the strings just all I'm break and it crushes. Hands, so you know. Yeah, exactly. Your gold hands crush the. Uh, Crush the the loot. Uh, if I can, I would like to grab a hold of Peaches. Mm -hmm. Just you can. in case things go too south. Yeah, you can you can hold on to her. As and like, as you're clutching onto Suika, pulling his uh, katana once again, or not pulling it, like starts slashing away at the uh, yokai's hands as he's being like held by the bones, but he's struggling. With advantage. Oh, with advantage. Alright, 16. And here's the other one. Oh. God damn it! God! I know. Oh no! What is it this? Is. As the Gashadakaru is What's struggling to slash away at the Gashadakaru, the Suika is. You see the hand start to close in on the watermelon yokai. And the little skeletons that like are all like actual size, so it's little compared to it. They start. Forming around this weekend, like reaching out from uh, the bones that they're holding onto, that like make the hand and grab onto the suika and crush the yokai. No! As he tries to slash when you can hear, goodbye, captain, captain. Rest in peaches. The, the yokai. Watermelons. Oh, no. Oh. My bad. Peaches, 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 peaches got a bit to go. Yeah. She's over here. Oh man, don't do that to me. <laughs> yeah, Suika, Suika's gone. As they would have passed their turn in spirit to low. <laughs> That's funny, sorry. <laughs> and the fan doesn't count as like a concentration thing, does that? No, it just, it just it Yeah. Okay. It just does. Uh, I'm going to cast Moonbeam. <laughs> oh. Damn, I should make a, a token for this spell. So, another con save. Mm -hmm. I want it right, on, right through the middle of it. <laughs> no worries, just give me a second if I'm going to just do this. Yes, yeah, so this just beam pushes through the sky and actually goes through the hollow of the skull as it like goes straight down its spine into the void and you can see the light refract off of um off of the um the the void 
and just shimmers like the sun and everything around you is like a crystal uh, randall as everything starts shimmering and refracting light as how much damage does the yokai take oh they've got to roll something uh, did it roll a concert it didn't roll shit <laughs> 21 it still takes half i believe yes it does uh 2d10 and it's fire damage mm -hmm. 12 damage as it burns through the central light within refracting off of the void uh, emanates Loniko's energy and radiance Randall as your it, you... is it Lo's turn again? I think we skipped my turn no no it's uh, your turn hasn't happened yet okay so yeah, Kano, Randall, new, uh, the, yeah, this the, is the popcorn order, initiative, yeah. yeah. Yeah, anything else, okay. uh, Lo as Randall, as, um, sorry, anything else, Low? sorry? Uh, I'll give a Bardic Inspiration to, uh, Randall. Mm-hmm. Well, thank you. Uh, who's been? Uh, Randall, Low, Peaches. Lagash, Dakar, uh, Kuro, Kano, and Satoshi haven't gone yet. Okay, I will give it to Kano. Okay. It's your turn, Kano. No, I forgot you had a cat. Sorry, the cutest cat. Okay, uh, I'm. So this thing is dragging us down right now. Mm-hmm. We're yeah. like in free fall, yeah. 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 Okay, since we're in free fall. How, what's the angle that the ship is at right now? It's like basically a 90 degree angle down. And we're not falling off the ship? We're yeah, you're not falling off the ship. ship yeah, you're still clinging on, yeah. Okay. But like, okay, if, like your hair here. is like going upwards. Mm -hmm. So if I jump, do yeah. I like fly forward? Roll me an acrobatics check if you want to try. <laughs> okay. All right, one sec. Uh, acrobatics. Oh! You succeed as... Do you want to? Oh, wait, I'm feared, aren't I? Oh, yeah, good point. I'm like, a, I'm like spooked. Yeah. But you can still jump if you want to. What, what does that do if I, uh, like, lunge towards him? You want to? Yeah, I want to try aiming for his head and, like, just... Start pulling. I'm gonna allow... Although you are frightened... Mm -hmm. I'm not. I'm going to ask you to roll me the wisdom safe now. As yeah, you learn, you leap, and you just see Kano plummet down into the void. Ooh. As Kano, you <laughs> get ready to punch, but as soon as you get closer, I get fucking screaming. It's like, what the yeah, you see the skeletons again, and once again, you see Moran. As she's doesn't wordlessly tells you to stop as she's trying to like uh, stop uh, catch your punch as um some more skeletons around also try to catch your punch and you just freeze but you are still falling okay mm -hmm. uh what do I do who do you want to pass your turn to uh who's left it is Satoshi and the Gashtakaru. I guess Gashtakaru is gonna go Thank thing you. yeah. <laughs> Why won't no one ever <laughs> ever Just hinder? Fuck that! I don't want to give smart this... in the shit, man. Especially this thing. I don't want to give this thing two turns. You don't got bonus actions anymore, though. I don't care. <laughs> two turns, it smack me down to like forty-eight health, or you know what I mean. <laughs> smack the hell out of you. <laughs> Good, because it is gonna do that again. God! It's not, don't worry, you say. But as like Kano is oh. reaching forward, it's gonna lunge itself down and try to eat him. Oh. oh. Well. Don't worry, I'll take it off oh from the inside. Oh my god. Weaker. I mean, for a it's skeleton, yeah. It's weaker on the inside, right? It has, it has no, no or... <laughs> Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You're good. <laughs> 
So I'm gonna break it apart just so you oh, can like I can, I can I can even Honestly, get your token. Getting eaten by this thing might be a good idea. Give me a second. I'm gonna bring you to the front so I can like put the token back together. <laughs> yeah, it, it's, it from the inside, boys. As it deals 12 damage to you, Kano. And that's it's biting on you or trying to eat you. As like it's all like you can see like it's like it's teeth are made out of other skulls, and they're all trying to bite at you. Oh. And they're gonna try and bite at you one more time. Um, Matt, Matt used a uh, used a uh, later action. To do oh, that. what? Excellent. D four. Let's see who who this affects. As I'll explain who that affects in a second. Thank you, Matt, for that Why? one. Okay, I'm gonna ask you to roll me a D100 and then a D20. Oh, brother. Oh, brother, this guy stinks! Six. Come on, D20? If it helps, though, technically it didn't move. Okay. Well, so you'll, but you'll be able to do your moonbeam on its turn. When, like, I mean, on your turn when you next next attack. Okay, got, did it get 26 on the second bite? It did. We'll get to that in a second. As Kano, you take six fuck? piercing damage. As you are like about to fall into a void within the void, as like you are staring into an abyss of yokai eyes. Write that down. Someone write that down. What? An abyss void within. Oh, a void within the void. I can't remember. The uh, the void within the abyss. Maybe that it's probably. Like that. Yeah, crazy. close enough. Someone chat. Write it down. Write it down. Write like that. I'm just good. <laughs> yeah, let me just let me let's see what you this as like one of the stars is swerging into the um into the void it flies into the mouth of the gashad car and smashes into you uh kano and as it smashes into you a surge of wild magic erupts off of you as like from within you guys hear a sonic boom as a uh, a wild magic search has uh, erupted off our boy uh, Kano. As what was your D20, please? Yeah, I got the last chaos gem. By, uh, the 12. 12? And what was your D100? 6. I got my last chaos emerald, guys. Oh, uh, fucking. Kano? Are you working for Eggman? <laughs> As you hear that noise, it opens its mouth. And Kano is gone. The fuck? I'm gonna put Kano over there. Kano, could you also? Did you fell that wisdom save? Sorry, yeah, never mind. Yeah, it disappears. Yeah. Well, Kano disappears as it opens its mouth, and you hear a cackling laughter from within. Add him to the monument. Satoshi is gonna. Second time I've had to watch Kato plunge into nothingness. <laughs> Thank you for that one. As Satoshi is uh, gonna <laughs> rush over to the cannon with you three, and then also try to try to use it. As they also gonna use try to break free from the fear as well. Hey Satoshi, did we install the bite mechanic on the ship yet? How long have I been muted for? Roll. <laughs> <laughs> Roll for me, uh, Randall, a wisdom save. I mean, wisdom check, please. Sorry, it needed to roll a con save at the start of its turn. Oh, did it? Uh, you want to do it on its turn then? Or... Is that for the movie? Yeah, because it, it, yeah, it's moving. Fuck! So it failed. So if you want to roll damage on that one? Alas. No, Captain! We didn't have the bite mechanic yet. I forgot to install it. Oh, that would have come in real handy right now. Yeah, it, it rolled a 7 on the con save. Yeah, we'll do Moonbeam on its turn then, uh, if it still stays in that area. Oh, uh, yeah, that's, that's that's the thing. Yeah, no worries. Yeah, it's like it starts burning away once again. All the bones start charring black. Give me a second. Uh, 
Um, but yeah, as... It, uh, blah, 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 blah. I was going to roll a deck save as um, a cannon roll 16. Oh, I didn't. I don't think I actually rolled it, did I? No, I didn't. Yeah, Satoshi's going to just like, ask, like, you ask about the, uh, the thingy. It succeeds. As the, uh, the cannon once again smashes into the yokai. But this time, Satoshi's aiming at the, uh, the arm that's holding onto the ship. And that arm just erupts and just breaks off. As it's just clutching on with the other arm onto the rib cage, just bending them and twisting them. Great shot! Thank you, Captain! As they're gonna pass their turn to you, uh, Randall. Randy? To who? Randall. Okay. Um. Yeah, I mean, I'm not afraid anymore, but it's not really on, so let's just keep doing cannon. Bad. Oh, did I click that twice? Hopefully not. It succeeds. Ah! As the cannibal goes flying around, as like you're trying to reconfigure for, as Satoshi turned it to aim it. But as that happens, it just twists itself as it's trying to let go of the ship. Anything else? Um, yeah, I'm going to swivel over here, kind of getting us all together in a bit of a unit. Mm -hmm. Just closer together, just in case something happens. Just want to get everyone... I can, I can make, I don't know how many of you guys I can lift, but I, I know I can lift some of the smaller ones. Satoshi, you can, I think Together, you're pretty Captain. light too. I am, I'm pretty, pretty lightweight. Together, Captain. Like a bucket of water. Just like a bucket of water. Together. <laughs> As Peaches and All Satoshi right. also uh, say it's together. Take a, take a good shot, Peaches. And I'll, I'll pass it to her. Mm -hmm. Uh, with it. Actually, does that count for... She doesn't. It would. I, I'll i give it disadvantage. I think it's only a melee, I think, is the thing. So I, that uh, might not work for that. I don't know. Yeah. But she, uh... It does succeed, so it doesn't even matter. As another peach cannonball was flying and just misses the gash of the car. Roll. Peaches is going to pass her turn to the gash of the car. Roll. As you're all just trying to hold onto the cannibal and like a cannon are holding together, it turns to you all and just reaches in as much as it can. As I'm gonna ask uh, Lo to roll me uh, her moonbeam damage, please. Moonbeam. Was it its turn? Yeah. Did it roll a save? I'm gonna roll it now. Is it was it was Constitution? Was it? Mm -hmm. Twenty one. So it takes 19. As it starts turning white again, but like from just like the heat. As the Gashtakaro, its mouth is just wreathing in fire and its like head erupts into fire. And like as it's erupt, uh, like becoming an eruption, Randall, you see it like almost emanates Hikana's hair as she launches. A fire, or as a skeleton launches a fire, uh, its fiery breath at you all. I'm gonna ask you all to roll me a deck save again. Boy, howdy! Don't you do, don't you do me dirty right now? Yeah, see, that's right there. That's the deck save king coming in. Not necessarily that twenty, <laughs> sir, but it's still really good. <laughs> After after watching the stream, everybody, you should watch uh, the Comeback King music video by <laughs> oh, Corey Lloyd. I can't remember what his name. Is. I don't. The remember. guy who the did Corey in the house. No. Fucking. <laughs> 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 Corey Feldman. Sorry, that's his name. The guy in all those '80s movies. The kid. He made a stupid music video. The kid that never grew up. 
I'm the comeback, comeback king. So. Oh no, I didn't like I, that. I didn't like how you said that. As it launches its fiery breath towards you low, as this even necrotic energy just wreathes itself around you, you are able to use your own shamanic and fiery energy to just like push the evil off. But like it still licks and just catches and just burn well not burns, but drags you down as you take what's it, half a twenty seven. It's a cold burn. Thirteen. Yeah, it's a cold burn. As you take thirteen. Randall, you also take thirteen. Don't say it. As you see Satoshi go to leap and protect peaches as she is just like frozen and as soon as like the fire lashes around satoshi as he like kind of like just curls around peaches to protect her satoshi evaporates as hikana's voice Sikana's voice can be heard. Why did you abandon me, Randall? Why didn't you take me with you? As with its other hand goes to slam at Lone Nico. Lon does 21 hit. Yes. Yeah. Wow. She takes what seventy question. damage as she just like gets. Oh, seventy. Sorry, go on. Yeah, as she gets pushed into Fuck, the ground. Those seventy damage there for a second. Yeah. <laughs> Holy as she, crap! As she gets pushed into the ground by the, uh, the 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 blow over the yokai and the cannon oh, breaks. Wait, make a con save. Is it con save? Yes, con save. What's concentration? Yeah, it's concentration. What save do you make for that? Uh, just a con save. Is it con save? Yep. God. Oh! It's still up. As your moonbeam still burns at the bones. And like, even when they smashed into did you, it you feel... Did just have a turn? <laughs> you feel... I already did it. Around the beginning. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. I remember. Did it? Yeah, it did. As it... Is trying to hold onto the ship, and the bones, even on the ship, are turning white hot. As you see a comet flying by once again. And as it's flying by and just curling around the void, you see Sing atop it with a cowboy hat, Kano. Yeehaw! As he's come swirling around. And is back here as he's just yeah, flying no. around the void. The one like uh, that got attacked to have some from mage. You as yet yeah, you another, as a star falling, as another star falls from the sky and gifts you low inspiration. Where is that? There you are. Low is your sorry, Kano. It's your turn then. All right, uh, leaping off the comet or. Or should I? What, what, what's the? Can I do anything with the comet? You can if you want to. You can try punch the comet. You can. Uh, can I like somehow even... angle it right towards him, towards the skeleton? Yeah, I'm gonna ask you to roll me a strength save or strength check. Sorry. Okay, strength check. Yes, that'll do it. I'm gonna ask you to you like your cannon attack that we put, uh, programmed into you. I'm going to yeah. count it as the heaviest. Okay. Uh, okay, so what do I do have to do for this again? I can't remember. <laughs> oh, the heavy was DC 18 to lift it. It or failed, so like, yeah. Oh, yeah, okay, DC 12, so yeah. yeah. That's even... And then it's eight or 66 plus strength. Yeah, so 66 plus 5. Uh... I should add a Kano to the... 
the character cards. I forgot yeah. to do that. 19. 19 damage. As yeah, like you just angle this flying comet and it smashes into the Gashidakaro's chest, erupting the rib cage, revealing its spine and its plate, uh, its uh, back plate, and just. It's you can see all the bones within just screaming and shrieking in pain. As Kano, you are falling towards it. Still, I would like you to like Sorry, latch onto. You you could either be falling, continue, or you can try and latch onto the body of the skeleton if you'd like. Uh, I'll try to grab onto the skeleton. Yeah, you can like well, you not grab on, but like specifically like land on it. Oh, yeah, okay, because like it's free falling vertically. Right, Are you able right. to like? I'm gonna ask you roll me an athletics check as well. Athletics or oh, acrobatics? Better at that one. Yeah, no worries. Yeah, you were just like <laughs> land on, holding on, clutching with your golden fists. Who would you like to pass your turn to? There is low uh, and peaches left. Let's go low. Low. What would you like to do? Um. I will uh, turn to Randall. Uh, like, stay with me, Captain, and I'm going to cast Cure Wounds again. I wouldn't be uh, too hasty about that. Look at yourself, Lonico. You're not looking so great either. Well, I'll be fine, Captain. You have to take care of yourself, too. As you heal him 13. by 13 hit points. Thank you. Anything else? Uh, and she is going to... She'll give a bardic inspiration to Peaches while she's in the way. Mm -hmm. um, that is the last turn on the banana leaf mm -hmm. and she is gonna run on down a little bit <laughs> that'd be like one of the best props to have for this the, bana the banana leaf fan i feel i want i want that prop what this <laughs> give me a second have you seen the art for it i don't think so i mean probably i think you have, I have the of. banana uh, I have the banana tree. Yeah, like it's there is art of it. Yeah. Oh, I could tell. I've seen that. We could do it. Let's. I mean, let's let's do it up. I'll send you guys a <laughs> legitimate banana leaf. Yeah, he's gonna make one. <laughs> <laughs> It'll be a me and Paris project. But yeah. As um, low you were annoyed. This peach is still left. As Peaches um, is... Sorry, go on. Unless there's anything else you nope, want to do? Nope, I don't know. Nope. Peaches... Unsure what she can do. You see her... Her eyes twinkle. As... Wild magic just surges off of her. As... The smell of fruits starts blooming off of peaches as her hair, fire in her hair starts to form into branches and starts turning into petals and flowers. And you can see her, like in this panic as she's just taking in the fact that like Satoshi's Satoshi's gone, the peaches turn to oranges. And she just drops to her knees and just looking up to you, Randall. It's your turn. Um. You can't give up yet, Peaches. We can still get out of this. I'll make sure of it. I'm uh, five. Oh, it's just lagging a bunch, so sorry mm. about this. Nurse. Sorry, case for like 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. That'll be right here. 
Does anything happen when I get near this like skull here? By the way, the dragonborn esque skull. Like, is that is that me? As you look at the horns and the scarring on it, yes, you know that's you. But instead of man, I guess, and as soon as you realize it's you, you see the bones crack and break, forming into. A crystalline skull. As you look down at it. No, no time for that right now. I, uh, I'm just going to go for a slash on him. Oh wow, yeah, unnatural 20. As his head just looks down at you. Or what's left of the skull. Is the jaw leg like, still on? Yeah. If I, yeah, I want to specifically, I'm trying to like kind of un uh, detach the jaw at this point. You do. As your short sword slashes away, and like as like it slashes at like one side of the jaw, as it goes to cackle at you. The jaw crumbles and breaks as like the heat from Lowe's uh, heat um, moonbeam, the blast of the f uh, the falling comet from Kano and all the cannon bolts you shot into it. It just crumbles under your force as the ship continues to free fall into the void as like you get pulled in with with the ship as. You fall. As the ship erupts once again. As you crash onto sandy shores. The coast to your east. An erupted mountain with a green aura emanating off of it against the black silhouette. The tides crash around you. As that comet that you saw from earlier crashes once more from up ahead. As Randall, once again, you are alone. As no sign of anybody else. Nobody else. I I get up, like really dejectedly, like like I. I feel like I know that this. It feels like this is gonna repeat itself over and over and over again at this point to me that I'm just doomed, to keep in these cycles of. Losing these people, falling from the sky, and coming back here to the beach. Uh, but I, d I dejectedly follow that path and see what's next. As you go towards what you've dreamed of, hoped for, and wished for with every fiber of your selfless being, sitting amongst a bush of lavenders, you see nestled in their forehead that shimmering shiseki stone of rainbows and rippling starlight. Rocky sits there, all the crystals in his body of the shiseki stone that you've been dreaming of, wishing for. And as he looks up at you, you both, your eyes cross And you wake up. I imagine I wake up with tears in my eyes. You do. And that's where we're going to end the session. Oh. 
they Thank kiss. you, everyone. <laughs> they may kiss. <laughs> and you kiss. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Thank you everyone for taking part in uh, this session, in this little dream. Um, not intermission, but uh, half session is what we'll call it. It's what we call it nightmare, Kaz. Yeah, sorry, nightmare. <laughs> <laughs> what a lovely dream. That all. Yeah, really. Like, can you imagine Kaz just waking up from that and being like, what a dream that was? Like, what a beautiful dream. dream. <laughs> you know, like, wow. Should be that into a like, and D session. I'd be like, man, like. What kind of fucking nightmares do you have, though? <laughs> yeah, really. <laughs> but yeah. As always, like, God damn it. Did you cry, Sam? Okay, honestly, I almost did. At the end, fuck. I I thought, because like you, I, everything here is shocked the hell out of me, and I thought at one point you were gonna bring up Lo-Fi Boy, and then I thought Sam was gonna show up in here. Oh, I, dude. Dude, I would have. I also screamed. thought you were gonna bring it low for like we did. Rest in peace, Sam. Holy man, that fucking. Just to clarify, Sam is not dead. Is he? Yeah. yeah. Really <laughs> we we Sam. Actually, I'd like to. I'd like everyone to say hello to Sam if he does watch the vods. This will get. He'll message me saying, oh, "I'm crying, Sam. guys." Hi, Sam. I love you, Sam. Hello, Sam. Same from you guys, chat. If you could, me. please. Wait. It is he. It is me. Hello. I still have like Hello. a fun connection with him because uh because uh Sai messages him a lot and Yeah. Uh, he messaged we were talking last night and he's he's doing he's doing better. Yeah. 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 So here's hoping we, we can get Sam, some the best. some lavender hues in the future. And um But yeah, that was Rocky. I mean Randall. Your dream. God damn it! Your nightmare. <laughs> yeah. Sam, you should have gone with a different name. It was too I close tell to you what, I said to at the beginning, I said, I was like, is an R name too close to Rocky? I, I said it. And, and Kaz and everyone was like, no, it'll be fine. He used to get low on the Sarah mixed up as well, if I remember right. Uh, don't, don't, well, don't, 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 <laughs> Okay, so noted. Next time we, and oh, Kaz no, has we, a campaign, boy, too. Like, you all nobody have can have the same. <laughs> Fuck's sake, man. Everyone can't start with the same letter. Yeah. You can't. It's it's game over, man. But yeah. Um. With that, we are gonna be. Uh. That's this week's session. We we'll join us for next week, where hopefully we will have Piper with us, or I'll have to give Lo Nico a dream too. We'll oh, see. Yeah, and then I'll have to. I'll have to come back, I guess. So. Yeah. Um. Here is regular. Because you're a dream. Just constantly come with bullshit reasons to bring me back. <laughs> yeah, like every time, like, and Kano appeared. Bro, that was such a sweet little moment, though, where it was like, it was like, yeah, like me and Miranda have been married for like, I was like, what? Cool. Oh. Yeah. To be fair, like, Kano, like, I mean. It's dream it continuity, well. that is. It is. Yeah, yeah, it's his head cannon, right. but he don't know in the spirit world. <laughs> Randall's hey, a shipper, man. I... He knows it. Like, yeah, Randall, Randall shipped him. So, like, he knows it. <laughs> that's, how, that's how he knows he's a mastermind. He wakes up like, Rocky was 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 Kano and, and Miranda married. He's like, what the fuck? They never talk. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think they said a single word to each other since we knew them. <laughs> I shipped him. I shipped him. Taya probably said more and it was just bullying fucking Kano. <laughs> <laughs> everyone bullied him. Every, yeah, everyone did. fun to bully. But with that, that is the session. Uh, so we're going to just raid into GM Hina, who's playing Baldur's Gate. So let's hit him with a vibe check with some di dancing dinos for Sam. Hell but want... yeah. But if you're subbed, let's put in a smug me. Cause like, actually, I've got a skull emote. That's like, a that's smug the me? Smug me. Like, as like, in smug. Smug Kaz? Or like... Yeah, smug Kaz, yeah. I'll show you a it's smug me. Kaz. <laughs> But like Why because of suddenly go to 1999 in quality. What happened there? Me? No, no, AJ. Uh, Did I? Yeah. So oh, now you're fine. What the hell? Was that just <laughs> on my end? Because it sounded like you just ran like a Motorola fucking telephone. I saw you a smug cans. Yeah. With that, we're gonna be waiting to GM Hina. If um, yeah, Rip, Rocky, and Sam, they they're gone, and Randall and Sam. He was here. He, no, he's, he's at a wedding. He, he just showed up. Oh, he's at yeah. a wedding? Oh, I forgot. No, oh, you did say that. Married? You Bro, did say that. How many times have you married your uncles? 
I'm sorry, what? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're gonna dance in dinos if you're not subbed. Skull Kazes if you are subbed. Thank you guys for taking part. Uh, there's a Discord if you want to join a community D and D game. Uh, we have art nights, game nights, movie nights, all sorts of things. And we'll see you either next session for Tass next Sunday or my art and prop run uh, or prop hunt stream on Tuesday or whatever I do uh, on my schedule. Oh yeah, thank you guys for hanging out. Fix your rolling system, roll twenty, because what the hell was this today? That was <laughs> uh, absolute nonsense. Of how many We've been, we had trouble with that with like with like Graydon too. He was pissed yeah. at roll twenty for that too. Maybe I'll have to message roll twenty. Um, as an ambassador. Anyway, I gotta go. Uh, yeah. I gotta go mushroom picking with with Cy now. Enjoy oh, your so mushroom cute. picking. Yeah, that's cute as hell. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. See you guys soon. Thank you for hanging out. Hey. And I hope you have a good morning. Bye. Roll twenty. Let's talk. <laughs>